Good morning, you guys. Today I'm joined by Finn. He has driven all the way up here because today we are doing probably one of the only abandoned places in Iceland, would you say? Yeah, well, there's not many of them. There's not many. We're doing one of the only abandoned places in Iceland today. You probably already saw the video because it was probably already out. But we're also exploring the West Fjords today and tomorrow. A whole bunch of new stuff. Uh, apparently the biggest cliffs in Europe, right? Well, the longest cliff. The longest cliff in Europe. Yeah. We're doing that tomorrow as well. We're doing a lot of fun stuff. But we come, we've, uh, we've come out here this morning to take the booster board and the drone up right by the harbor. We drove in here late last night again, so we haven't seen any of this. You're seeing this for the first time, as I am. Let's see what happens. So, uh, we're taking up the twins today. It's like seeing double. Look at this. Two drones, two of the same backpacks. This is gonna be good. So we have woken up early here in this small fishing town in the West Fjords. No one else is awake. There's no cars on the road, pretty much. And I'm loving this town. It's such a nice, beautiful, quiet day here. You guys want to race? Yes. All right. Let's go. <laughs> I gotta catch up. He's he's going hard. <laughs> I didn't have to work nearly as hard as you guys did. I'll see you guys later. Take care. Unexpected, but also very fun meeting up with those kids. Now we have to go find uh, where this abandoned place is. We just stopped on the side of the road because we saw this uh, kind of hot springs. I mean, natural hot springs that no one has made into a lagoon yet. Finn, I think this is our our chance to start a uh, a new a, really hot. a new blue lagoon. This is what I love about Iceland. You can just stop on the side of the road to some steaming water and feel it. Ooh, it's like a hot, you could, you actually could not sit in this, it's no, so it's hot. it's too hot. This is actually too hot. That is so crazy that you can stop on the side of a lake and find water that is too hot to actually sit in. Wow. Maybe when you mix it with the cold water over here. Yeah. Look at, just look at the color of the water here. It's crystal clear right here and there's just all this stuff around. Thermal springs. The real reason we stopped is because it's fall here in uh, Iceland and you don't get to see it very often. But the the grass here is red and yellow, just like the leaves back home. Which is really cool, so we wanted to stop here and take some pictures. But look at this fog. me yesterday that there's a volcano that is very close to erupting down south uh, so if that does erupt then I'll be stuck here for weeks because it'll be going off for a while for sure, at least a few weeks at least a few weeks 
So my flight is on Monday. I'm just hoping that it doesn't erupt before Monday because then I'd have to take some kind of submarine to get to where I'm trying to go. And I don't know if I can rent a submarine. <laughs> I don't know how expensive that is. But I just hope it doesn't erupt before Monday. We keep stopping along our way just because we're in the West Fjords and the West Fjords is probably one of the most beautiful spots here in Iceland. We've come up on the shore and there's all these huge uh, driftwood logs on the shore. The, uh, Finn was saying that you could actually come here and just camp. You just take this wood, make some circles, and you can just start camping. Look at this. This is just so cool. But I guess we should probably carry on. Just had to stop here for a quick moment to see what was around here. We keep getting distracted on our road here to this abandoned herring factory, but I mean, we had to stop. Look at these mountains in the background here. There's no way. It's a fantasy world over here. We had to stop. We're actually about to be in this town that has an abandoned uh, herring factory that we wanted to go to. It's a town called Dupavik? Dupavik. Dupavik. And we were going to film there, but Finn talked to his friend there, and they're actually shooting the movie Justice League. So they have rented out this whole town, and if we go to film there now, we'll get sued by Justice League. <laughs> so that was actually where we were planning to go originally, but now we're going to another town north of it to find another herring factory, which is abandoned, which also looks cool. But it's just crazy to think this place that we're actually going to go film, because we thought it looked cool, Justice League is actually filming at. So who knows, maybe we'll see Batman at this place that we've seen pictures of. Check it out, we've stopped because there's a bunch of seals over here. I'm gonna try and go down there and get their picture if they don't run away. Or, <laughs> they can't run, but if they don't flop away. <laughs> Imagine they start running. If they... Look at this baby seal right here. Oh no, he's flopping away. I said don't flop. Oh, they're all gone. We finally made it to the abandoned place. We just finished this video, shooting this abandoned video. It was a really good one. If you haven't seen that one yet, go check that out. I'll have the little annotation here for you to go check that out. But we're heading off now. We have to go explore more of the West Fjords. This is where they're shooting the Justice League movie. Uh, they just say it's a commercial being shot here, but they're prepping. There's a lot of construction workers building the set for this place right now. You can see over there they're doing some stuff. The movie hasn't started filming yet, as you can see. There's not, a, but I mean, there's not a lot of people around, just construction workers. But uh, this is pretty much the same exact thing. It's a herring factory, just like the one you were just at. But this is going to be a movie, so they took our idea. Just let it be known that I filmed here before the Justice League. When this Justice League movie comes out, I'm gonna compare my footage right now to this movie to see how it looks when that movie comes out. That is crazy. It's like a uh, Christmas tree right there. <laughs> Wish I could show you just how much of the day goes by when you're driving. But we did a lot today. I mean, we got a lot of cool drone shots. We did some uh, boosted boarding. We did a cool abandoned place. So if you haven't seen that video, check that out. Finn and I are going to start editing. We've got a lot of drone footage to go through, and uh, we actually have some more adventures that we're going on tomorrow. So if you haven't already, subscribe to Finn. We're going to go on uh, a lot more adventures tomorrow. We're doing you know, some waterfalls, some... Waterfall, cliff, and one epic beach. And an epic beach. Yeah. <laughs> so we will see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> but it can go a lot slower, too.